The following is a production of New Mexico State University. Hi, I'm Mary Meyer with the New Mexico Department of Health WIC Nutrition Program. I'm excited and proud to be here today to introduce our Family Health Television Series. The WIC Nutrition Program provides nutrition education, supplemental food, and health referrals for pregnant, breastfeeding, postpartum women, infants, and children up to the age of five for moderate to low income families. Our Family Health Series is a collaboration between the WIC Nutrition Program and New Mexico State University. These television programs provide support for families to develop lifelong healthy habits. If you're participating in the WIC program currently, let your local WIC office know if you have watched this episode today. Welcome. My name is Stephanie. Thank you for joining me today. Kids love to move, and a great way they can be physically active is moving like animals. I'm sure you know that WIC promotes healthy eating, but did you know they promote physical activity too? And as a parent, you can be an important role model. By being physically active with your child, you can help build healthy physical activity habits. Even small children can benefit from physical activity. They build motor skills, learn balance, coordination, teamwork, increase self-esteem, and reduce their risk of chronic disease. And physically active kids have better appetites too. So what is being physically active? Essentially just moving. It doesn't have to be hard or take hours out of your day. It's as simple as taking the stairs instead of the elevator, taking short walking breaks, doing housework, or just putting in your favorite song and dancing. And you and your child can still get benefits from as little as 5 to 15 minutes of activity spread out in different intervals several times a day. Remember, being physically active with your child should be fun and it's a great bonding opportunity. In today's show, you'll meet Julie and her son, Adam. I'm going to show them how they can be physically active in their home by moving like animals. Clear off some room in your family room. Put on some comfortable clothing and some supportive shoes. And let's get moving. Are you guys ready to have some fun? Have right. you ever noticed how animal, animals move? Each animal moves different. Today we're going to be physically active by moving like animals. Does that sound good? All right, we got to stretch out a little bit, all right? Let's take a deep breath right here. Take a deep breath, good, and blow it out. Take another deep breath. Good, and blow it out, good. Now can you take your arms up above your head? Good, we're gonna pretend we're squirrels, all right? Let's reach up nice and tall like we're reaching for an acorn on the top of a tree. Reach, 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 and let's Pick that acorn and let's take it to the ground. Good, take it to the ground. Let's reach up nice and tall, grab that acorn, and let's put it back on the ground. Good, one more time. Reach up for that acorn and put it back on the ground. Good. Let's pretend we're birds now. Let's take our arms out and flap our wings. Good, flap your wings. Good, good. Now let's take those wings and roll them forward. Good. It's always important to stretch up, stretch out and warm up a little bit when you're being physically active. And let's move them backwards. Very good. Good, good. All right, you can put your hands down now. Let's be penguins, all right? 
First, we're gonna move our head. So we're gonna look to the side, to the front, and to the side, and to the front, and the side, front, side, front, side, and let's hold our head to the front. Now penguins walk kind of funny, don't they? So let's waddle like penguins right here. Put your feet out wide, point your toes out wide, and bring your arms up to your hips. Can you try it with us? Put your feet out wide, good. And if you have room in your house, you can go ahead and move around. We're gonna move around in a little circle here. Let's go ahead and move around in a little circle. Waddling like penguins, right? Good. Good. Why don't you just stop right there? Do you like monkeys? What kind of noises do monkeys make? They eat bananas right from the trees. So let's pretend like we're a monkey and let's reach for those trees. Reach, reach, good, reach, reach, reach. Keep reaching, climbing that tree. Get those bananas. Good. Now what stuffed animal do you have there in the corner over there? That's an elephant and what do elephants have? Big trunks, right? So use your arm. Let's pretend like we have a big trunk. Good. What do elephants like to eat? Peanuts, right? And let's use our other hand in, as a trunk. Good. Now let's add our legs to the side right here. Can you move your legs while you're moving your trunk? Good. And let's move around. Let's move around. Go ahead and follow me in a circle. Good. Moving your trunk. Good, and switch arms. Use your other arm. Good. And let's just stand in place right here and pretend like we're an elephant. Moving our trunk. Yes. Now we're gonna pretend like we're fish, all right? So we're gonna move our arms out together and separate and bring them back in. Good. Out, separate, and bring them back to your chest. Good. Out, separate, and bring them back to your chest. Good. And you can try it with us at home, too. Good. Now we're gonna move our arms. Move your arms. And then bring them back to your chest. And look, let's kick out our legs. One to the side and one to the side. And use your arms. Good. And kick out your legs to the side. Good, to the side. And move those arms again. And kick out to the side. Into the side. What else lives in the ocean? Sharks and dolphins. Let's pretend to be dolphins. Can you be? Yes, good. We're diving through the water. Good. And we hope we don't get eaten by a shark, right? Whales are bigger. Right, keep swimming, keep swimming, keep swimming. Good, now we're gonna move, we're gonna sit down. We're gonna pretend like we're at the bottom of the ocean, all right? We're gonna be crabs. So come up and let's walk around like crabs. Good, keep moving this way. Walk around on the ocean bottom. Good, keep walking, good. Yep. All right. 
good. All right, let's go ahead and stand up. What kind of movements do bunnies do? Right, they hop. So let's hop like bunnies. Good. Good job. Why don't you come back here? Good. Now, do you know the story of the tortoise and the hare? The tortoise was a slow turtle. We're going to walk around like tortoises. Let's walk around really slow. 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 And the hare was a rabbit. And he moved really fast. Can you walk fast for me? Walk fast. Good, keep walking fast. Good. Now we're going to be like the tortoise again. Slow. Slow. Stretch out your legs. Good. Slow. And let's walk fast again like the hare. Keep going. And walk slow again. Good. Good. We won't step on your eyes. All right, let's go back to our places. What do kangaroos do? They hop. So we're going to take big jumps like a kangaroo. Good. Good. Keep doing your kangaroo hop. Good. 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 All right, let's go back to our, pla our places. Now we're going to do something like, you know what a panther is? It's kind of like a tiger. So we're going to push to the forward and push to the side, and push to the other side, and then we're gonna scratch our paw. And we're gonna push to the front, and to the side, and to the other side. And we're gonna scratch our other paw. And we're gonna push to the front, to the side, to the other side, and scratch that paw and press to the front, to the side, to the other side, and scratch that paw. Good! Yeah! We're doing, great. We're doing great! Are you having fun? Let's try to, let's take a water break. Good! Here, Mom, have some water. We're gonna take a little water break and we'll come back and move like animals in a few minutes. Remember, it's okay to take breaks while you're being physically active. And water is important. Remember to drink it before, during, and after being physically active so that you stay properly hydrated. Also have healthy snacks available for your child in case they become hungry. Things like fresh fruits and vegetables, low-fat milk, cheese, and yogurt, and whole grain crackers and cereal are excellent healthy snacks. Besides moving like animals, think of other ideas you and your child can do to be active. Playing with the balls, going for walks, or playing at the playground. When being physically active with your child, don't worry about technique or form. The most important thing is that your child and you are moving. If your child doesn't get something, that's all right. Start simple. When your child feels comfortable with something, then introduce more advanced movements. Be patient. And remember, being physically active should be fun for you and your child, not unpleasant or a punishment. Let's get back to our mother and son. We're going to be physically active and move just like the animals do. Did you guys drink some water? Are you ready to start moving again? Yeah. All right, we're going to be animals again. 
we're going to be start by being a big crocodile. And what do crocodiles have? Big teeth. Use your arms. We're going to have big crocodile teeth. Good. Yeah. They eat hippos. All right. Make big arms. Big arms. Good. Yes. Good. Good. Big crocodile arms. And look, let's switch arms. Other way. Other one on top. Good. Yeah. There you go. Good. Big arms. Big arms. Put them wide. Yeah. Good. Now, do you know what an orangutan is? An orangutan is like a big monkey. All right, and he lives in a tree. So we're gonna move our arms like an orangutan. Good, excellent. Bring, move your arms in front and back. And we're gonna lift our legs up. Good, good. Keep moving. And do you know what kind of noise orangutans make? Whoop, 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 whoop. Whoop, whoop, whoop. So let's move around like orangutans in a circle. Go ahead and follow me, like following the leader. Good. Whoop, 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 whoop. Whoop, 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 whoop. Good. Keep moving. Woo, 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 woo. Keep moving. Now, someone told me that your favorite animal was a zebra. And how do zebras move? Fast, right? So we're going to gallop like zebras, right? Right. You're a fast zebra. And where do zebras live? In the jungle. Gallop like your zebra. Keep moving. Good, keep moving. All right, now we're gonna pretend like we're on a farm. What on a farm makes a cock-a-doodle-doo sound? A chicken or a rooster? Let's be roosters. Let's put our arms up like wings. Right, and we're gonna march and prance. And what are we gonna say? Right, cock-a-doodle-doo, and let's go in a circle. Move in a circle like a rooster. Good. Cock-a-doodle-doo. Keep moving. Good. Cock a doodle doo. Good. Keep moving. Flap those wings. Good. All right. Let's go back to our start position. Now we're going to be a frog. What do frogs do? Oh, yes, they jump. Let's get down and let's jump like a frog. Rip right. And they do make ribbit noises. Good. Ribbit. Ribbit, 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 good, ribbit, 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 ribbit. All right, now we're gonna go in all fours and we're gonna go back in the jungle and we're gonna be lying. We're gonna crawl around. All right. But we want to do it slow, like the king of the jungle. Be a lion. Right, keep crawling like you're a lion. Good, keep crawling, crawling around. A mommy and a baby lion. All right, and let's come to a stop. Let's come to a stop. And what do lions do? They like to stretch. So come on all fours and let's stretch. 
stretch up our back. Right, stretch up your back. Good, and come back down. Good. Good. Now we're gonna pretend like we're snakes. Let's let's slither on our stomach. Good. Slither on your stomach like a slithering snake. Good. Slither like your snake. Good. It's hard exercise as a snake. It's breaking your neck. It's all right, we like to be active. All right, let's stand back up. All right, and let's come back over here. Let's pretend we're birds again. Let's flap our wings. Good, good. And let's move them a little bit slower. Good. Slower. Good. And remember that, remember that acorn on that tree? Let's reach up for that acorn. And we're gonna slowly, we're gonna slowly bring it down to the ground. Good. And we're gonna reach up for that acorn and go back down. Good. And let's go back and flap those wings. Good, good, we're going higher and higher. Good, good. Now what was your favorite animal movement that we did? Zebra. The zebra. Well, let's be zebras again. Let's go ahead and move. Remember how zebras move, right? Right, good. 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 And let's be a lazy zebra. So we're gonna go a little bit slower. To be a lazy zebra, a tired zebra, right? Tired, lazy zebra. All right, take some water. Remember, it's okay to let your child take small water breaks. Good. Why don't we try to be a panther again? So we're gonna push to the front, push to the side, push to the other side, and we're gonna scratch our paw. And we're gonna push to the front, push to the side, push to the other side, and we're gonna scratch our foot. Good. And again, Adam, push to the front, push to the side, push to the other side, and scratch that paw. And we're gonna push to the front, push to the side, push to the other side, and scratch that foot. Adam, let's go ahead and walk. We're gonna walk slowly in a circle. Walk in a slow, walk in slow. Now it's time to go slow. Good. Good, walk very slowly. Good, and go ahead and stand right there. Do a deep breath, can you take a deep breath? Inhale, and blow it out. And another one. Inhale, inhale, and blow it out. Are you done? Inhale, we're gonna finish stretching. And let's stretch up mom nice and tall. And go to sit down. Thank you for joining me today. You guys did great. Did you have fun? Thank you for joining us being physically active today. As you can see, it's fun and you can do it in your own home. You wanna keep doing some more? No, you're done? Remember, it's okay, kids sometimes need breaks, and when they're done, try doing more activities later on in the day. 
as you can see, being physically active with your child can be fun. And try to be physically active every day together. One way you can do this is think of all the physical activities you like to do together. Make a list. Put it on your fridge at home. And as you do those activities, check them off. Try to do all the activities on your list in one week. Also, set goals for yourself. 15 minutes of dancing. Once you've mastered that, then try to boost up the time. Dance a little bit longer the next day. If you need some ideas, check with your local WIC office. They can give you ideas or even have classes for how to be physically active with your child. If all else fails, remember you can always turn on the music and dance. What we eat and how much we move impact our health. Start today to build lifelong healthy habits for you and your family. Hello again. I hope you've enjoyed the show today. If you have any questions regarding information you've heard today or would like information about the WIC Nutrition Program, please call 1-800-280-1618. And do join us for other family health episodes in the future. Proceeding was a production of New Mexico State University. The views and opinions in this program are those of the author and do not necessarily represent the views and opinions of the NMSU Board of Regents.